To create a survey using SurveyMonkey, go up to the Create Survey button and this will be the first step to create your survey. You can copy an existing survey and then edit it as you wish or you can start from scratch. Put in a suitable survey name, so I'm going to call this Teaching Learning Centre Sample Survey 1. If you tick this button, My Questions Are Already Written, you can then paste from a Word document or elsewhere your questions and SurveyMonkey will attempt to set it up for you. Here we're just going to set up a survey from scratch. So SurveyMonkey creates the new survey with a blank template. So we can choose to add a new question and you have a range of different types of questions from multiple choice to drop down options to comment box and a single text box, so one line of text. So here, if we want to add a multiple choice question, here we could say the sex of the respondent and allow people to choose male or female. We don't, we only need two options here, so male or female, allow more than one answer, no, and score this question. We're not going to be scoring uh, here as well. We can choose to add another answer if we wish, and under options, we can change, for example, the layout here so that it's horizontal, taking up less space rather than a column of answers. If we click save here, we'll then see how the question is presented. And you can see now the options are presented horizontally for you. Let's add one more question. So here, let's add a comment box. So enter your question. So I'm just going to put the word comment for somebody to add a comment. Under options here, we can require an answer, like any other question, uh, to this question. Adjusting the question layout is quite useful, so you can make it, for example, wider and maybe give more space if you want people to have more lines in which to encourage a longer, more detailed answer. Click Save, and again now we have our comment box added along with our question. We can edit a lot of features and also change the colour, add a logo, and we can then preview and test and we can see how the survey will look. Okay, that's it.